Okay, guys, what's going on today? Hopefully everybody's doing all right. So today, guys, I thought this would be a fun little comparison video where we're going to talk about an OLED screen compared to a WVA screen. So on the right, we have the XPS 157590. And on the left, we have the Inspiron 157591-7000 series, two-in-one touchscreen laptop and non-touch. So I'm just going to show you guys the difference. Um, as you know, the OLED, again, on the right, has deeper blacks, which also makes for contrast to be very high, a whiter, brighter screen, juicier, more vibrant colors um, compared to the WVA, which is a step up from the IPS. But as you know, these laptops tend to have screen bleeding and the IPS would uh, actually be on the bottom list. They would have the most screen bleeding. But the WVA is supposed to be better. But it, we're not here to talk about screen bleeding. That's actually another video I might do, guys. So I'm going to turn off the lights and we're going to dissect the coloring, the brightness, um, all that good juicy stuff. Um, so let's go, guys. Don't be scared. The lights are off. And what do you guys notice right now from a distance? Do you notice anything by looking at the OLED screen and by looking at the WVA screen? I notice something off the bat. Um, I notice if you look at the sign Outworld, off-world, off-world, right? It is so much more whiter here. Definitely looks off-white on the screen, as you can tell. And even if you look at the car, you look at the, this is a Blade Runner background, guys. You look at the car, those whites aren't as bright compared to the white there, the white headlight on the car. Um, that, so that's a difference I noticed off the bat. And the color here looks kind of blurred. It shouldn't be. I think it's because we're back too far, so we will zoom in quicker. But I'm going to show you also the detail. So let's start with the car, guys, from here. Um, actually, we'll look at the car and the off-world sign. So we can see how, you know, the car is lit up very nice, and the black is definitely black. And you look at the sign, it looks pretty white, right? So let's just go right over here to the Inspiron. And I can tell the car looks decent, but the black doesn't look as black. The white on the car doesn't pop as much as the headlight. And this whole sign here, off-world, where you can buy all crazy stuff off-world, the sign is just duller lighting. Um, as you can see, it's not really white. It's off-white. And I'll just show you back here real quick. You can see that. And this actually looks a little more white, you know, a little more true to color. And by the way, I'm recording this on the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus 4K video quality with 60 frames per second so we can get the most accurate. Let's kind of look at it this way and you can see the sign just look at the sign there guys it's definitely whiter on the other on the right screen on the oled all right so let's go into the try and look at the actually i guess we better go on close we're going to look in here about here and you see the atari store you know you see a lot of things on the screen here that looks pretty lifelike doesn't it? looks like you can walk right in there with all the colors and the fog and everything and then we're going to take a look over here on the wva it's not bad, but it just looks dull. Um, it's not really popping. Um, and as you can see, now there's, you know, it actually looks a little blurred, some of the area. And if we go over here at the same range, you know, it doesn't look as blurred. There looks like there's more detail. It looks like I could actually walk in that Atari store, pick up a 2600, maybe play some Miss Pac-Man, you know? And we'll just go out a little bit. You guys can get a better look. Yeah, that's sign, guys, right here. That is so off-white. Um, again, compared to that, which is definitely more white and pops more. And here's just how the screen looks um, in full size, pretty much. And we go over here, and here's how this looks full size. So that was just a little comparison, guys. In my opinion, the OLED definitely looks a lot better. Um, whiter, brighter, which is just very important. Um, actually, maybe I can show you files real quick and just show you the brightness thing because that's that's a big difference. So here's just the you know the screen. You look at that, and then we look at the screen over here. Look at that, guys. Look at the screen on the right. How much more whiter and brighter that is, and then on the left with the WVA, it's just dull. Almost looks a little yellow. And these are both maxed to the brightness. Everything is equal. All the settings are equal. So that pretty much sums it there, guys, to be honest with you. So um, hopefully you enjoyed the video, guys. Any questions, comments, let me know. Please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe. You know, all right, all right.